Brothers, welcome back to Territorial.io. We're starting off today here in the world in a 70 person free for all. Now we are going to put our spot in the middle top portion of Asia. I just kind of hope that that spot lays still and people don't come too close to us. I was about to say, if so, I'm happy to move down to Africa, but Africa is also looking like a terrible location. So our spot actually worked out pretty well. I mean, a lot, not too many people actually came that close to us so yeah um that's really good and no one spawned in last minute so another huge plus so what are we looking for here what is our goals well obviously in this particular portion i'm a little bit too far away to pull the uh, peninsula trap in the uh, northeastern part of asia so i'm honestly just gonna be expanding in the ways whatever the bots ways go and we'll just kind of see about making truces with who's strong i'm not really keen on making too many truces at, le at least initially in the beginning portions of this game i'd much rather be an attacker be the villain if you will <laughs> so we'll just be attacking some weak bots you know doing our thing being, being with some role players but uh well actually this is working out really well we're actually hitting most of the bots in great timing so this is we have the crown pretty convincingly so and a great number of troops to go along with it and we still have more bots to go so this is going super great for us as our lead over overall on the map is about 5,000 pixels so huge ups for us as we get some great advantage we'll go ahead and grab these islands so no one can go around us to do anything and uh we'll see what's gonna happen player 52 is very weak Ooh, do i want to get involved okay well since he left <laughs> i guess that makes my decision easy yes i will get involved in that and this guy left as well wow Huge moves for us. And then notice me, Senpai. <laughs> Great name, by the way. Uh, is also super weak. So we're just going to go ahead and push into him. Now, Drug Empire is what who I would like to be on my next target. But Crusader, if I can jump in on this, I think would be a perfect target. And we this green player to our south is also in on it. So let's just go ahead and reload this. Now, we are a little bit weak, but our pixel count is, you know, lead is about the same, about 5,000 pixels. So actually it's decreasing so whoever is bobo is doing some work now i'd love to push into the drug empire let's go ahead and get some truces with people who are saving up their troops and uh kind of see what's going to develop here uh i'm thinking honestly everyone's very distracted right now except for the hre that uh i'm just gonna push into drug empire just give some nudges just give some nudges he's so close to death as long as people don't all gang up on me, I think I'm going to be fine. But Castle of the Flesh is being my bullet sponge right now. Just getting absolutely obliterated by four players at once. Oh, poor guy. I've been there. We all have. Oh, and he left. Oh, that's so huge for us. Oh, that's gigantic. As we get a tremendous amount of land, we very strengthen our pixel count lead. And now it just becomes who do we attack next? And the McDonald's employee is looking like a juicy juicy target with only about 280,000 people but uh this um this guy's attacking me <laughs> what are you doing uh i guess he actually has like slightly more troops than me but let's see if i can kick him off oh a mcdonald's employee left oh another huge development for us we get a bunch more land for free and this guy's back he's attacking me again wow he just really wants japan okay cool bro <laughs> i mean i'm not gonna let you boat into my land so i'll just you know knock you down but I will remember this. I will remember you as uh, we will be on a mission to build up truths as NCR is attacking Hawthorne. That's interesting. I don't know why he would do that. That's kind of <laughs> what is he on some kind of suicide squad? But, he, you know, he's got 200,000 troops and he's pushing the Hawthorne. He's got 1.7 million. But that's fine by me. Gives me a little bit of opportunity to build up troops. Roos is very big. He is uh, about 4 million troops himself. So he's keeping on par with us. I'm thinking Hawthorne, I was about to say, someone's gonna bite, someone's gonna bite in his love thy neighbor. <laughs> Another hilarious name, keep them coming. Love the great names. Everyone's in on Hawthorne. I'm just gonna sit back waiting for that. That's exactly what I was waiting for is the full send. We already were in the position where we had the crown. We didn't need the land. So building up troops was much more valuable to me than jumping in. And lo and behold, look who I have borders with now. It's our buddy. Hello, sir. Do you remember when you were crazily attacking me and now I have six times your troops? Yeah. Well, we'll knock him out of there. You know, GG's to you, sir. And then uh, we'll see what kind of target we want to go with next. Now, I know a lot of you want me to attack the HRE, but he's my buddy. I don't really want to go after him. He's been with me since the beginning. 
Uh, I honestly want to go after... Uh-oh, he's pretty weak. He's only got about 2 million troops. Ooh, and he just asked for alliance. Well, this is super awkward <laughs> as he full sends us, but that's okay. We get managed to get a lot of land out of this. Unfortunately, we're cutting HRE off even more, so he is fully surrounded by us and only us. Don't worry, little buddy. I'll protect you. As we push into Luxembourg Empire, I think that will be a really good target for us. We just have superb borders with him, and he's only got 5 million troops, so... Now, this could be a mistake. Roos is uh, very aggressive, but no! Oh, HRE left. Okay, well, at least he didn't full send us. We get a lot of land out of this. Uh, if Roos attacks, honestly, I feel like I could finish up the attack on Luxembourg Empire. And oh, speak of the devil, here he is. Hello, sir. That hurts my feelings when you attack me like that. Well, we'll just go ahead and push into him. We'll try and get a truce with Love Thy Neighbor so we don't get triple teamed on this because that would probably be the downfall of us. But Love Thy Neighbor doesn't have a lot of reason to attack me as he doesn't have great borders if he did throw his weight behind um a, this attack he wouldn't get much out of it so i'm thinking he's going to stay out of it in fact he joins us in attacking luxembourg empire fantastic news is once again we are in a great position to win this game so we'll just take out luxembourg empire and maybe deal with uh the threat that is the Rus. the Rus is uh very threatening he's got similar troops to us now granted his troops are nowhere near uh, as, well, let's just put it this way. I have not hit my limit where he is approaching his, and we are quickly outpacing him. We've got about 14 million troops, so let's go ahead and pick a target and just go after him. Hopefully, we can incite a early full send so we can move on to greater things and not get bugged down and uh, potentially teamed up on. So that will be what our goal is to do is uh, he's got 6 million troops. He, oh, there's the full send. Perfect timing, so that works out really well for us. We did unfortunately miss uh, an attack down there. Love Thy Neighbor is really going super hard in on attacking the other guy in Africa. I'm not that concerned with it right now, but I'm making a mental note of that. I'd much rather get the free land and keep my focus here on taking Roos. And uh, that will be very good for us as we'll just take a few of these islands just to solidify our lead. And then we'll grab this as well. And that's looking really good for us. Now, love that neighbor. Wow, super weak. Um, this is going to be really awkward, but I'm going to need your land. I'm sorry to betray you. Also, great name. But uh, uh, I feel like I'm going to be challenged here in the world domination sphere, and I would rather have less enemies than more, and I feel like you would maybe betray me. Call me crazy. Uh, but having all of this land really kind of secures our victory. Now, granted, we are not in a state where we are out of the weeds just yet you know if they all coordinate an attack they have more pixels than me so let's go ahead and take down the strongest of the players this little this little facey boy here so he's at 17 million now we're doing a really good job of knocking him down i just want to keep an eye on bobo and making sure that he doesn't boat into me oh and he full sends the hasbula oh my gosh what a great move for us good move for us but now we got to get over there so let's send boats everywhere all the boats are being deployed Hopefully they get there in time to do some damage. Hasbala, he left. Oh, wow. Okay, well then, oh, and he left too. So <laughs> for the first time ever, North and South America are completely vacant. And uh, until we get over there, let's go ahead and send a boat down to Bobo as well. And uh, we'll go ahead and grab some of these islands while we wait. So there's not much more for us to do other than kind of clean up here. And I don't think Bobo is going to be too, I don't think he's going to have the, well, he's not going to have the troops. I hate to hate to be mean but he's he's a little bit out of it at this point so we'll just wait for our boats to land start taking who is this who's this okay well we'll take you out that's a uh, little buddy over here so knocking him out getting the north and south america and uh now we'll just begin the process of grabbing all the little baby islands and yeah this is my favorite part wish they would connect this that'd be super cool just you know for the sake of i don't know just uh Speeding up the end game a little bit. I feel like that's where everybody gets bogged down. I'm sorry, Bobo. It's been great playing with you. I'm gonna I'm gonna go and take your land though. And as we quickly wrap up, Bobo will be grabbing the rest of these islands. I am gonna just briefly cut away to get to the victory screen. I know not a lot of people like to watch all this, but stick around for the next vid for the next match. And there it is, boys. GG's to all involved, and on to the next game. All right, next map up is going to be a little team action on the Halo. Now, this is a very small team action game. There are nine players in here, so there's a good chance. Oh, actually, we do have a teammate, Max Lowe. 
number nine on the leaderboard we are number one i don't know really where he is though up oh, there he is he's to the south so we are starting on opposite sides of the board i'm feeling like this is going to be just a quick little game win or lose just to kind of fluff up the end here but you know some people really like these team games and i love these like non geographical maps i know they don't get nearly as much love as they do so i want to spread the love by playing them hope you enjoy them too so what what are we looking for here not a lot we're just gonna be growing as best as we possibly can now i am going on the inner peninsula just in case i do get cut off i can kind of work my way around it by boating I'm not going to be going to the middle island. I feel like that is kind of a death trap until the very end of the game. So we're just going to be focusing in on attacking some bots. We do manage to get the crown right away. And this is very much a bot race game. So we're going to be a little bit aggressive in grabbing as many bots as we can and worrying about managing our troops later. We're going to have a lot of time probably before we touch another player. I don't see anybody near us, at least in the initial game. So we're looking pretty strong. We do have a good start now. What I am fearful of is getting ganged up on, um, ganged up on by bots of the same color. So we're going to eliminate that problem. Uh, problem when bots of the same color are all bordering you and they have nobody to attack any other than you, they will go ham on just like full on throwing their head against the wall into you. So uh, we're going to go ahead and boat over like we talked about. That is because we are cut off by our yellow bot Ike, I think that is. So. We'll just keep pushing out here. I'm going to be zoomed out pretty heavily just to make sure that I'm getting as much land as possible and also not going into a crazy threat like, you know, new Echo over there. He's got 100, uh, 200,000 troops. So we'll be cautious of that. Honestly, I'm not the most worried about it. I can definitely cut back my troops and take a few hits to save up troops to, um, you know, outmatch him. So, and we do have a lot more bots to go. So let's keep pushing. I was very concerned initially in this game that, uh, oh, these guys are in a clan, the Magenta Bros. But I was very much concerned in the beginning of this game that I was going to be cut off by my yellow bots. That has not happened to us at all. We have free reign. Although, unfortunately, now we are kind of coming to the end. But that is right next to some players. So I don't mind having that little stop gate. Giving me a little bit of time to build up as we do approach uh, Phi. Now, Echo below us is in the middle island. Okay. So what is our plan here? Well, Maxlow is still around. That's really good news. So I'm thinking I want to attack the white player and just kind of leave Phi alone. So... Uh, with that, just to kind of build up max low. So with that, we're going to be saving up. Although, actually, he's super weak. So let's actually attack him right now. Okay, he's not that weak. He just had a lot of troops deployed. <laughs> well, that's a little bit unfortunate for us. But he is all alone on his... Oh, well, no, British Empire. Okay, so it's two whites, two uh, magentas, and one black. Okay, so I think we're going to keep our target as is. I am a little bit of concern with getting attacked by Fi. But uh, I think I want to... i re much rather have a stronger healthier teammate than taking out Phi right now so let's go ahead and push into that i feel like if i just pushed into Phi, then Al amori would just come at me anyways that's not nice of you brother <laughs> giving me an attack i'm the one who attacks how dare you well we'll just keep pushing into this white player commit to the one that we have attacked hopefully we get some help from max low or the black player my land but uh let's just uh first off grab all these little tiny bits of land that I did not manage to get and just kind of wait a little bit. I want to build up a slight bit of troops to make this attack on Amaru just a little bit faster. Hopefully we can get, feed most of this land to our teammate as I don't really need a ton of it. It would be helpful to separate from Phi just a top by a bit, but I'm not the most concerned. Echo, I see your boat, sir. Hello, are you coming over? Well, I'm going to quickly knock that off as soon as possible. So as to not have to deal with two of these guys at the same time that might be the downfall of me especially with the white player still on the board white player is down to a million he might have just done a full send of some kind but let's just go ahead and attack him as that is the end of him he did full send so that's really good news on our end as we very much extend our lead by 4,000 pixels so or 40,000 pixels excuse me uh and honestly next target i want to have is my land i know i'm, I'm getting attacked by five I'm just plain old ignoring that. I'm just trying to build up max low. Now, I am going to knock off Echo from coming onto my islands. Sir, that, you stay where you are. You stay in the middle. You're in timeout, okay? So, we'll just push into my land, slowly starting to knock him down, now, and just completely ignoring Fi and Echo. And there he goes. There's my land out of the way. Max low is going to get a lot of this land, so he's going to be a very competitive force going forward. And now, we will begin the onslaught onto Fi 
Oh, an echo leaves. Oh, buddy, you just lost your friend. Okay, well, with that, this is going to quickly wrap things up here. So we will just continuously push down Phi. Oh, fuck. Now, you know what? That makes things a lot simpler if you just leave. So now we begin the wrapping up process of taking down the rest of the land and then the British Empire as well, fulfilling what America did in 1776. All right. <laughs> Uh, as we wrap things up here, boys, I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching, especially if you're new around here. And as we wrap things up here, I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching, especially if you made it this far in the video. If you have made it this far in the video, hey, give it a thumbs up. It really helps me out a lot. If you're new around here, subscribe for more. I put up videos every day. And also, boys, do not forget about the Discord. A uh, link is going to be in the description for the Sunday subscriber special joining in. And I will see you guys in the next one.